Welcome to the channel PDT Express News subscribe to the channel and don't miss the hottest news of the day our today's newsletter includes the following content. Yang Zi announced the good news, netizens, it's not Zhang Yishan? I've long seen something wrong with you. Recently, Yang Zi appeared on the red carpet of the Starlight Awards, wearing a sparkling haute couture, exuding the confidence and courage she had gained from being a child star. Yang Zi has been in the entertainment industry for more than 10 years and has worked hard to produce countless works. This woman is really amazing. At a time when film and television dramas were in a downturn, Yang Zi dominated the screen in film and television dramas with Shanghai Love and became the king of drama in 2023, winning nine awards including TV Actor of the Year. Overnight, Yang Zi became synonymous with the drama circle. Even before her long-time love aired, she had already attracted everyone's attention. She plays Huang Yingzi, a cute and beautiful young girl, Fan Changcheng plays Zhang Yi, a handsome man full of literary talent. The audience is looking forward to the next performance of these two childhood sweethearts. When talking about Yang Zi's childhood sweetheart, Zhang Yishan is what everyone thinks of. The classic urban sitcom A Family with Children is a well-known comedy. Yang Zi and Zhang Yishan brought a lot of joy to everyone in the play, and their friendship is also enviable. The friendship between the two people that has accumulated over the years since filming made them quarrel, dislike and complain about each other as soon as they met. With the continuous development of the times, the entertainment industry is also a mixed bag, but the friendship between Yang Zi and Zhang Yishan can still maintain the existing friendship after going through ups and downs, which is really rare and precious. Yang Zi said that Zhang Yishan is her most precious friend, and the same is true in her heart. The two are like brothers and sisters. When attending events together, Zhang Yishan will hold the microphone and lift the hem of Yang Zi's skirt, taking great care of Yang Zi. When Yang Zi was speaking, Zhang Yishan squatted quietly aside to hold the microphone for her, looking at her intently. Zhang Yishan said that Yang Zi was someone who could ravage him unscrupulously, and she was the special woman in his life, just like family love. Two people will immediately send blessings to each other on their birthdays. When Yang Zi broke up with Qin Junjie, netizens teased Zhang Yishan, saying that his chance had come. Over the years, everyone has been waiting for these two people to make further progress of a different nature. In contrast, friendship can allow two people to stay with each other for a longer period of time. In the complex world of the entertainment industry, it can be said that Yang Zi is very lucky to meet a friend like Zhang Yishan in her life. In addition to Zhang Yishan, the friendship between Yang Zi and Xiao Xian also makes many netizens envious. In the show, Xiao Xian said that her best female friend is Yang Zi. She jokingly said that in order to ensure that Yang Zi's good friend was also her, she would check Yang Zi's interviews. Yang Zi and Xiao Xian met while filming Ode to Joy and gradually became sisters. How enviable it is to have such an ironclad friendship in life. The two of them would visit each other's studio when they were filming, and they would spend some time together to chat about their recent daily routine. Yang Zi and Xiao Xian participated in Dear In together. The two of them stayed together all the time, sitting on the same bench and hugging each other even when drinking water. Xiao Xian is very attached to Yang Zi, which is a sweet burden that makes people jealous. When the guests saw it, they all said that these two people would stay together for the rest of their lives. Sisters have to do everything together and lose weight together. One said he didn't need to lose weight, and the other said he had to wear a dress for two days. As soon as the front foot finished speaking, the back foot completely forgot about it. The two of them were holding a leg of lamb and gnawing on it, and the joy of the food made them dance. If you want to gain weight, let's gain weight together. Isn't this the happy daily life of two best friends in reality? Xiao Xian also mentioned in the show that the two of them talk about everything and even share the remuneration from their scenes without any scruples. Xiao Xian said that it is really rare to find a friend like Yang Zi in the industry. When filming Ode to Joy, the two of them were so good that they slept together. In addition to the family ties of blood, in this strange society, it is not easy to find a friend who gives without asking for anything in return and can stay by your side firmly. In front of the camera, many female celebrities in the entertainment industry are very enthusiastic with each other. Netizens think that they are just pretending, but in reality they are just plastic friendships. 
it is speculated that they are fighting openly and secretly, and grabbing resources privately. This is all part of what the audience sees, plus personal prejudice. The entertainment industry is indeed a bit chaotic, but there are still many true feelings in it. Lu Tao and Qin Hailu, just like the friendship between Yang Zi and Xiao Xian, are just their upgraded versions. The friendship between these two people has gone through 14 years. Lu Tao said that Qin Hailu was the person she could not let down in her life, and Qin Hailu said that Lu Tao was the person she could not let go of in her life. The two people have been helping each other and supporting each other until now. How close are they? At that time, Lu Tao's husband was bankrupt and had a debt of 700 million. Most people would hide as far as they could when seeing this kind of situation, but Qin Hailu gave up half of her assets and even sold several properties to help her. She told Lu Tao that she would do her best to help. What kind of revolutionary friendship is this? When Lu Tao came back from the trough, Qin Hailu was like her life mentor, thinking about her before and after, and analyzing ideas for her. The role of Mishu in The Legend of Miyu was recommended to her by Qin Hailu. When the movie Let's Get Married was about to start filming, Qin Hailu suddenly discovered that she was pregnant, and Lu Tao immediately came to her rescue. Qin Hailu suffered from severe depression after giving birth. Not to mention taking care of the child, she was unable to take care of herself and didn't want to do anything. Lu Tao stayed with her for seven months and took care of her out of the haze of depression. At that time, all the children's supplies were prepared by Lu Tao. As a mother, she had never bought anything for her children. Everyone's ridicule of the friendship between female stars in the entertainment industry is actually a stereotyped reflection of ordinary female relationships. There is no such thing as fire protection, theft protection, best friend protection, the friendship boat can capsize at the drop of a hat, women just like intrigue, these are all kinds of tarnishes on female relationships. When the variety show Sisters Riding the Wind and Waves first came out, the reason why people were more attracted to it was because they wanted to see a bunch of women poking at each other's sore spots on the stage. In fact, it disappointed everyone. The sisters in the show showed the audience that the relationship between women is friendly, enthusiastic, and positive. How many people have come and gone in your life, but you know that I will always be by your side as long as you are there. In the long journey of life, meeting a good friend who works side by side and is considerate is something that many people dream of. Good friendships are like Yang Zi, Zheng Yishan, Yang Zi Chiao Xian, Lu Tao, and Qin Hailu. Who are your friends? The schedule of Yang Zi's Sauvignon Blanc 2 has been postponed, which may make way for Qin Yin Yin 2, and the series will be reduced. Sauvignon Blanc, as the most popular costume drama this summer, has undoubtedly achieved very dazzling results in all aspects. Not only did it dominate the popularity list, but it also featured all the main and supporting actors. It can be said that the drama is truly popular and popular, which is very surprising. The popularity of the first season naturally makes the question of when Sauvignon Blanc 2 will be aired become the most concerned issue on the entire internet. Originally, when the latest schedule of Goose Factory was released, there was hope that Sauvignon Blanc 2 would be broadcast in the first quarter of next year. However, with the emergence of more new dramas and the adjustment of relevant arrangements at Goose Factory, Sauvignon Blanc 2 has now been queued behind Qing Yin Yin 2, making way for it. Referring to Zhang Ruoyan's previously revealed schedule for Qing Yin Yin 2 to be released in June, this means that Sauvignon Blanc 2 will have to wait at least until Qing Yin Yin 2 is finished. There is no hope of starting in the first quarter of next year, and it will basically be postponed to only in the summer season can we really start broadcasting. Moreover, in addition to the related schedule being postponed again, it was also revealed that the series of Sauvignon Blanc 2 will be cut, or it will be cut from the previous 21 episodes to 19 episodes. Sauvignon Blanc 2, which has a lot of famous scenes, only has less than 20 episodes. This undoubtedly made many viewers complain, and even worried that such a volume can really tell the whole story. Do you understand? You know, in Sauvignon Blanc 2, with the four male leads such as Yang Zi and Zhang Wani, Deng Wei, and Tan Jianxi continuing to star, basically all the characters have maintained the consistency with the previous season, and there are more plots here, more powerful players will join, which will upgrade the strength of the entire lineup again, and the overall popularity, attention, and competitiveness will also become stronger. After all, 
Thanks to the popularity of the first season, Yang Zi is now firmly in the top 90 traffic charts and has become one of the little flowers that can best carry dramas. Zhang Wani's popularity has soared and he has made up for the shortcomings of ancient costumes, and his popularity and development have become even more outstanding. The current popularity and market favor of Deng Wei and Tan Jianxi are also very good. Not only have they both won their respective male lead dramas in costume, but their subsequent resources and celebrity positions have also improved significantly. Even Wang Hongyi and Dai Lua, who were only moderately popular when Sauvignon Blanc aired, also reaped a wave of drama bonuses. The former Wang Hongyi jumped from being unknown to Tang Yan in Yan Wushuang Mail No. 2. Dai Lua has appeared in many popular dramas one after another, and related resources have also come up. Therefore, under the character filter of the first season, the popularity and enthusiasm of all the leading actors are higher than before. With such a good-looking and popular starring group, Sauvignon Blanc II obviously has a more high degree of protection. In terms of plot and story, the excitement of Sauvignon Blanc II has also been fully upgraded. After going through various preparations in the first season, in order to help Xin Xin consolidate her strength, Xiaoyao agreed to marry Qishui Fenglong, but on the wedding day, she was robbed by Xiang Lu. This is where the most famous scene in the whole play takes place. Xian Xian successfully ascended the throne and directly began to pursue his own ambitions and ambitions. However, he was still obsessed with his feelings for Xiao Yao. Tu Shan Jing will experience life and death again before he can truly understand his relationship with Xiao Yao. As for Xiang Lu and Qi Shui Fenglong, they died one after another in the subsequent war, which will become one of the biggest tear-jerking points in the whole drama. In addition to most of the plot being narrated according to the original work, Sauvignon Blanc II has also been changed in some details. For example, Xian Xian did not harm Tu Shan Jing directly, but instead stayed in the illusion. After Tu Shan Jing was persecuted by Fang Feng Ying, he was not rescued by Xiang Lu, but instead relied on Xiaoyao's elixir to successfully save himself. The final retreat location of Tu Shan Jing and Xiaoyao was also changed from the sea to the forest. Many small changes, without affecting the layout and mainline advancement, also add more different highlights to the plot. Whether you are a fan of the original work or a pure drama fan, you will be attracted and surprised by these new settings. Of course, in the end, whether Sauvignon Blanc 2 will have to wait until next summer to be released, or whether it can be released on schedule, we can only wait for the subsequent official announcement. But with the original cast members such as Yang Zi and Zhang Wani starring, and a more exciting plot, Sauvignon Blanc 2 will definitely be the absolute king of costume dramas no matter when it is aired, and it is bound to set off a stir the most intense drama-watching craze. This concludes our news section. Welcome to leave your thoughts in the comments area. Let's discuss together. Welcome and don't forget to give me a like and follow thank you all.